Hi guys, this is John with Planet Tech, and this is the new version of G Develop. Now, it's I I did like the old GUI of the older one, um, and then they updated it with this whole new GUI, and so I'm learning this one because I just got used to the older one. But I got asked to do a drag and drop tutorial, and it seemed easy enough, so I decided, hey, why not, and figure out how to do that. Um, because the older systems mm, still needed a little bit of a cleaning. So we got that with this. And so we're going to learn how to do a drag and drop on this. And then we're going to make it an, adva uh, an advanced version. So we're going to do a drag and drop um, video game. Kind of a match card game. Either that or some sort of like tower defense where you can drop down towers. And do all that stuff. Um, also, if you, um, there's another creator doing awesome tutorials on this. His name is Sparkman. Um, he does his tutorials a little bit differently from what I do, but he's actually, um, also really good at this game engine. And so you should also check out his videos, um, if I don't have one up yet. So let's get straight to this. Um, so as you can see, I have a new object. So I just imported a random image. This is one of my game share, uh, controllers. Okay, so um, it has certain properties. So, edit object. Okay, so it is basically a regular sprite, but it has behaviors in it called draggable. Now we're going to get straight into that with a new object. So I'm going to click new sprite. We're going to add an animation. We're going to click on an object. I'm going to go to um, this effect right here. Since that will work, uh, preview it. It would be nice if we could actually scale these a little bit bigger, these windows. But that will do. Now what we're going to do is we're going to go into behaviors. We're going to click the plus sign and we're going to say, hey, I want this to be draggable. Hit apply. And boom, there we go. Now what we're going to do is we're going to hit this play button to launch the project. And I can click on it like this one and drag and drop it anywhere. Now this would be great for a tower defense game to where you could click on something. Uh, first make it uh, make sure that the behavior is set non-active and then you would drop this uh, from the little GUI menu onto our scene and then it would become active and then it would shoot down bad guys. Alright guys, I know that was a really quick video. I'm going to be setting up a demo uh, for us to, to go through, so a drag and drop matching card matching game. Um, you know, where you match A to A, B to B, and all that stuff. Just, you know, as I do with all my tutorials, you start simple. Then we work into some really, really awesome stuff. That's a little bit more hardcore in cases some events are coding. And we're going to get into that. So, like, subscribe, comment down below. Hopefully, you guys enjoy this video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.